morning students a cheerful and pleasant good morning to all of you today i want to discuss with you homophones contractions and abbreviations first we begin with homophones what is a homophone a homophone is a word that is pronounced the same as another word but differ in meaning a homophone is a word that is pronounced the same as another word but differ in meaning we shall now look at some important homophones with their meanings and uses in sentences first we have adapt and adopt a d a p t adapt means to become adjusted to adapt means to become adjusted to a sentence could be we should adapt ourselves to the circumstances now adopt a d o p t adopt means to take up sentence he has adopted a son next we have accept and accept accept a double c e p t accept means consent to a sentence could be i accept your offer i accept your offer except e x c e p t means but sentence all except shubha were present there is it clear okay next homophones are flower and flower flower means f l o u r flower means grain powder a sentence could be flour is made for making bread and f l o w e r flower means part of a plant sentence the rose is the queen of flowers next pair of homophones are idol and idol i d l e idol means without work a sentence is he is idle these days idol i d o l idol means image sentence many people worship idols next we have loose and loose l w s e loose means not tight sentence for you i wear loose clothes l o s e loose means cease to have l o s e loose means cease to have sentence we will lose everything in gambling principal and principal are the next homophones here p r i n c i p a l principal means chief or head sentence our principal is a kind man p r i n c i p l e principal means rule of conduct sentence he has set principles of life next we have s t o r y story and s t o r e y story s t o r y story means tale sentence we hear stories from our parents s t o r e y story means floor of a house a sentence for you we live in the upper story students these are some of the homophones there are also others given in your notes read them and learn them well
Our next topic is contractions. What is a contraction? A contraction is a shortened form of one or two words. To make a contraction, you leave out one or more letters from the original two words and replace them with an apostrophe. Let's look at some examples. Am. I am. I have. I have. You are. You are. Aren't. Are not. Didn't. Did not. What's. What is or what has. That's. That is or that has. Whose. Who is. Who has. Here's. Here is. Students. Contractions are very easy. You can also learn from your notes. Is it clear? Okay. Now we move on to abbreviations. What is an abbreviation? An abbreviation is shorter form representing a word or a group of words. What is an abbreviation? An abbreviation is Shorter form representing a word or group of words. Let's look at some common abbreviations. First, AD, Anno Domini, BA, Bachelor of Arts, PC, Personal Computer, PO, Post Office, RBI, Reserve Bank of India, BC, before Christ, Dia, Doctor, STD, Subscriber, Trunk, Dialing. There are also other abbreviations which you can find in your notes. Take these as very important. As for your homework, try to solve all the worksheet exercises and send them to me by 9 p.m. today. All the best. Take care and God bless.